The earliest film item in the South End collection records the visit of the Home and Atlantic fleets to the Thames off South End in 1909. Thousands flocked to the town to see the spectacle, and special trains ran from London to bring visitors to South End. The local paper of the day reported that 10,000 people cycled from London to see the fleets. The whole affair was a catalyst for feverish festivity in the town, with decorated shops and firework displays. The pier had to be closed several times during the week because of overcrowding. The huge attraction was more than 150 ships under the command of Rear Admiral Sir William May in the huge battleship the Dreadnought and Sir Charles Briggs in the Lord Nelson. A sign on the pier welcomed Admiral May and his TARS. Far from being a static display, the visit of the fleet was very lively, with a great deal of toing and froing, not only of visitors, but of the vessels and their crews as well. There are reports of worried fathers and daughters confined to home when thousands of seamen came ashore. Among the VIP visitors to the town to see the fleet was the Lord Mayor of London and the Japanese royal family. And not surprisingly, the pier made a profit that year a substantial £3,000, which was a lot of money in 1909.